very beautiful Taurus here as a feminine energy you're looking amazing this throne this is like financial stability this is like material wealth this is you looking grounded in your garden and beautiful everyone sees you as very stable and, and adorable hi I'm Sonia intuitive empress so this is a collective reading for Taurus don't try and force the crown to fit. It might belong to a different king or queen. And know that it is fluid, so it could be flipped around because it's a universal crown. So know that this could be flipped around with the person you were dealing with. So it looks like you've been dealing with quite a bit of conflict. You're kind of like moving forward from the conflict. You've been quite wounded in the situation. But it looks like it's been a karmic situation with a connection that you've had. This is a beautiful card here. This is like this connection that you've had. This is these people are looking not so happy, but it's like this is a beautiful um, card here, which is about a connection. So it looks like it's a past connection that you've had quite a bit of conflict in. You've been the wounded warrior. You've got it's like it's been you've been trapped in a situation. You have it's like a karmic situation. You could be a fire sign. You could be you know you could have been dealing with a feminine fire sign which you are moving forward from. So um, Leo Sag or Aries. But this person is very exuberant and bubbly and able to manifest a new beginning. So that could be you. You could be this exuberant, beautiful queen here, feminine energy. This is fire sign energy as well. So you're moving forward into this new beginning. You're charging forward and you're really starting to build up stuff. You could have a platform where you're rising above and you're looking pretty amazing, you're looking really cool. You've started this new beginning where you're forging forward after this ten of, ten of ten swords in your back you've had with lots of conflict with a lover. Yep, they've made you wounded, someone from the past. So you've got these two cards here, so this is Wounded Warrior, so both of you have been ended up wounded from the situation. They're looking quite sadly to you while you're looking at your wand, you're ready to manifest something new. But you're both quite wounded from the situation. This is someone you thought that was your soulmate and it's been a love-hate situation. And it's just been fights and endless wounding and painful stuff. You know, fights and conflict and so much of this old stuff. Someone from the past wants you to come and, wants to come in and give you an apology possibly this is a karmic situation this is you've been trapped in your head take off the blindfold and smell the roses and see what's really ahead what's going on from the situation you're moving away you're moving away from conflict and from being stuck in the situation because you're walking for you're walking away you've had enough this person was smug and didn't really want to work with you they didn't want to give you nothing they're just happy they're keeping all their cups to themselves really stingy person that was just pretty much like um a bachelor they wanted to be a bachelor but you're very independent now you're looking very abundant in your garden there you got a bird in your hand so you've tamed this, this bird just like you've tamed this you know beast so you're like cuts free from these types of situations you've got five pentacles there ready to share with somebody to get your ten of pentacles financial wealth so you're building something new and looking amazing you got your paintbrush in your hand and you're really other people are looking up to you seeing what you're doing and thinking wow this person is so good you've gone and you've gone with it and you've really done some healing things are moving fast now and it's really coming together wow this other person really didn't want to give much to this relationship they really wanted to just keep it all to themselves see you up there working very hard creating this beautiful new masterpiece you're a mentor for others. You really are quite amazing. You're shining a light and you're a guide for others, helping them show the way. And things are coming, moving really fast now. The really messages are coming in. And this person that didn't want to work with you, they're holding on tightly to their one little coin, not realizing that you are like getting blessed so much. And now they're sort of looking disappointed that they didn't give you their coin. Ha <laughs> ha, poo poo, too bad for you. Oh, it looks like you're really moving forward into karma waters. You got this card here, which shows that you're moving away from this disappointment. This person who didn't want to work with you, and now you're looking amazing, standing out real bright. So this person was a masculine figure in the past that you were dealing with. Someone they didn't want to do bugger all. They just wanted to be stubborn and have all the control and be. Now they want to come and apologise because they see you as this beautiful, this beautiful person. See this person here who is so stubborn and controlling? 
He wants to come and give you this cup of love saying that he loves you and he cares because you have this beautiful feminine energy. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And you are looking lovely there. Maybe you could be a mother or someone that cares for others. Like you could be a counsellor, someone that's loving. This person could have been an air sign. A Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Well, this could be you as well, masculine figure. But, oh, it looks like that you have had to boss up and cut, it up, cut people out. But this looks like we've been dealing with this masculine here. It looks like you started out on a new beginning recently. You started out on a new journey where you're getting messages of money coming in. Something exciting just for you. The universe is blessing you. Oh, lordy, it looks like you've been blessed with all sorts of stuff. And someone else has got anxiety because you're really getting standing out. This is a new beginning. This is a financial new stability. You have, you've done so much healing on yourself so from the situation. In the past, there were so many swords you had in your that you were, that was stabbed into your heart. Three of them particularly, and now you're doing the healing. You've really recovered, and you're getting this beautiful blessing. This is happily ever after. This is everything you could ever want. Beautiful cups there lined up for you with a rainbow just for you. Just for you. Because you've been blessed with this because you've been so strong. You've really done the work on yourself and you're really quite amazing. Eight of Wands. So things are moving fast now. They're really coming in. Everyone's messaging you thinking, wow, what have you been? Oh, they want to give you their cup of love. They want to celebrate with you. Someone is crying though. Oh, woo boo hoo. <laughs> this is like really moving fast now. The ships are coming in. All the messages and everything. Everyone wants to know what you mean. <laughs> so you've got the magic wand now and you're manifesting something new. The, the world has got in your hands and you're really doing well bringing it in. Because you've got the manif magic, m magic touch, like the Midas touch. You're really able to manifest whatever you touch. Everything you want is coming in just for you. This knight in shining armour wants to give you his cup. He really thinks you're beautiful and he wants to just be something stable and loving for you. While someone else is crying, they're crying over spilled milk. They didn't see you as their blessing, they just wanted to go and have a party and drink up by themselves or with their mates. Boo hoo. So it looks like the future, there's someone that's quite stable. Someone maybe that wants to marry you. Huh. The Hierophant. This is like a marriage card. This is like stability. This is the 1111 card where there's celebrations with somebody over here. This is like the marriage card. This is celebrations. This is a wish fulfillment. This is even an Aquarius. But this is an divinity. This is beautiful energy. You have done the work on yourself and you're getting blessed with this new opportunity. Someone from the past wants to come and give you their cup of love, but it might be too late because you're already moving down this new path. So this has been a permanent ending that you have broken free from, but you still have fears about it because it was so painful. You're walking away from the smug bugger sitting there. Ten swords on your back. You were broken and, and done. You're walking away now. You've had enough of this disappointment from this person who was smug and thought he would just have all the cups in the world for himself. But now you're abundant. You're covered with money. You have tamed a bird on your hand like you have this, this person who wanted to play games. And now you're moving forward after this painful ending down this new path where you are abundant and beautiful. This person's coming rushing in so you be careful. They want to stop you because you pulled down this tower because it was built on faulty foundation. They're falling out now because they, they didn't know you would cut free and move away down to this new beginning. They want to come and apologize. Oh it's too late. You poor thing, you poor thing. I'm walking out the gate. <laughs> judgment. This is judgment. So they're getting their karma while you're getting rewarded. And spirit is called 
blown the trumpet. They still want to apologize for the tower that fell, but you're taking a leap into this new beginning. And it's amazing, this reward. <gasps> you got, this is like a blessing. This is the, the spirit has called. They're getting their karma now because they just walked away from you. And like um, you're getting rewarded while they're getting punished. They want to apologize to stop you moving forward because this tower has fallen and they're just falling on their head. This has been built on faulty foundation. But you're taking this leap of faith into this new beginning. See, you're going to go jump now with your little doggy into this new beginning. And you're getting blessed by the universe for equal give and take while they look like they get nothing. Oh, what was me? You get their share too. And it looks like you're moving forward. You're really taking off. You are jumping into this new beginning and you're really doing great. So you're moving away from this masculine figure who wanted to be stubborn and didn't really want to help. He just wanted to play games and really be controlling. But you're this abundant person who has stability and really quite amazing. You, this could be somebody that's coming in for you. This could be you, Taurus, because this is an Earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. There could be, so it looks like you've had this ending. It's been very painful. And you're moving forward now. You could be getting a new car, especially with the blessings that are coming in. Because you're getting blessed now with Ten of Pentacles, money raining down on you. Little doggies as well. And grandparents and parents. So this is like financial generational wealth. This is money stacking up here because you've worked so hard to get this. And this is justice for you because you've had such a painful ending. You are getting karma because of this way that you've been treated. And you are getting blessed with this financial new beginning. Where you're getting all the money raining down on you. And everyone else is crying who's mistreated you. Good for you, Taurus. So happy. Bye.